the Xbox One, besides having, you know, a video and maybe a camera feed if you have a Kinect installed. And one of the things I've been trying to find out is how to how to do push-through notifications with my setup that will allow me to basically call out people in real time when they subscribe or when they follow or something like that. Because I really like I really like that facet of streaming of being able to you know immediately say hey you know X person thank you for uh, thank you for for you know giving us a follow and thank you for you know more or less subscribing blah 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 and there's no way to do that with my setup there are push notifications you can have sent to like like your cell phone or something like that but as far as I can tell it only works with the Twitch iPhone app. And I have a Windows phone, um, because I like it, believe it or not. Uh, but I have a Windows phone, and so there's no way I'm ever going to be able to get those. So the only way I can really do it is by keeping my uh, keeping my email up, because I get an email notification every time, uh, like somebody subscribes or something like that. Um, so that's really the best way I can do it, and unfortunately that isn't completely in real time. You know, there will be like a minute delay between somebody following and me being able to say, hey, thanks. Uh, it's the best I can do right now, so I do keep it up. That way I can, you know, thank people in the stream when I when they do follow. Uh, but, I don't know. The fact that there's a Twitch app built into the Xbox One really makes it easy to stream, even though I do have the the ability to stream different ways and like throw the, the stream chat in, etc. Um, I don't know, I really like being able to do it from here. I like I like the purity of it. I can't, you know, I can't throw like a thousand ads up on the screen and, you know, be one of those annoying fucks who just like their entire stream is covered in like monster ads and shit. Which is fine if you're trying to do it or if you're trying to stream to make money or you're streaming and you're sponsored, I completely get it, and I'm not knocking it, I just, you know, I, I like a more friendly stream environment as opposed to, hey, this is a business stream, you know what I mean? Business streams are cool if it's like showing off a new, showing off a new thing, or kind of like giving clarifying information on a new thing. Uh, the example I will give is I just recently watched the uh, Dark Souls 2 stream, the Scholar of the First Sin stream, where they kind of talk about the game a little bit, and uh, they were going over like Steam pricing and stuff like that, uh, which is, you know, fairly important. Oh wow, so I grabbed the thing, and now here comes a badass boss fight where I may die permanently forever. But I, streams like that are cool. You are so streams where there's a purpose to it. Young one. I am the least of your concerns. Like our stream yesterday morning where the purpose was to get a thousand gamer score in uh, the Fast and Furious Forza Horizon game, which we totally did and was totally awesome. And I made a pretty badass highlight of it showing some pretty gnarly failure followed by, you know, ultimate victory, which was cool to see. Hey, look, it's that guy. Hey, I think we're going to have to kill that guy. Because he's a dick bag. My blood thunders within me. This fetid air fills my ravaged lungs. Yeah, you are alive. You're also a dick bag. I'm alive again. You're welcome. Don't forget your part of the deal, cool. There's Get your dumb story. Stand. He's a guy, and Very now he's alive, well. and he's gonna help us. The but he's not really trying stands. to help us. He's just being a douchebag face man. My sanctum. So, yeah. He hasn't quite betrayed us yet, but that shit's gonna happen. Trust me. And we're about to fuck him up. Spoiler alert. Fuck it, I don't I don't know. Oh look, we walk over here and he tells us something last. I can contrived and super important, work. I guess. Oh, we'll tremble at my power. Oh no, he turned bad. Who this? could have possibly yeah. expected that that would happen? How has this happened? <laughs> the souls of the dead lords of hell have been absorbed into the stone. Abandon your quest, Nephilim. Your allies seek only to control you with the power I offer. 
It's like you this guy tries to could rule corrupt us and turn us to the dark side the whole time, and he's he's just so short of being like, I'm your fucking father, asshole, don't talk shit. Oh, those guys are burning down real quick. We need to get out of here. That is totally a slow time damage field. That's not cool. We don't want to be in that. Yay! My lawn is getting mowed outside, you guys. I'm very happy about that. I love the smell of freshly cut grass. Yay! We did it! We're the best around. And no one's going to ever bring us down. There was no high stakes feeling to that at all. That was actually have been kind triggered. of shitty and anticlimactic, honestly. Ooh, that'll be much better once we throw our uh, gems in there. Anything better here? No? No? No, nothing good here? Okay. It seems my brother. All right, time to get the Black Soul Stone. Me. That's racist. Why's it got to be the Black Soul Stone? Why can't it be the African American Soul Stone? Five lords of hell now reside within this stone. More story this shit. You're doing, Adria. And we're about to do some ago, awesome stuff. This this act starts off kind of slow and goes pretty slow stone. through the whole thing. Um, but there's me. kind of a you there's kind of a unique boss rush boss so rush at the end of the game between vessel. this and the boss yes, we're about to fight daughter. here. We may I actually have some some trouble with this boss that's coming up, but we'll we'll see. We'll find out here. I have a feeling this boss we're about to fight has some pretty gnarly damage spells. So I may spend some time here actually trying to buff up our health regen and defense as much as possible. Because I do not... As funny as it would be for me to go out here at the first Lord of Hell we fight, I would rather not. <laughs> I would rather be able to continue the stream because I like this stream. It's fun. Let's see. Let's see if we can't combine some green gems here. Nope, nothing to combine. Whoops. So we're going to socket our square emerald into our breasts. Oh, hey, we got a spot for a perfect emerald as well. That'll be good. So what do we got? We're at 78.3k defense and 22k health regen. I wonder if we can't uh, craft some items up here to uh, increase that a bit. Drop off all our extra gems here. There's really no reason to clear out the inventory space because, I mean, we're not running low on inventory space or anything, but it's still nice to keep things... Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's still nice to keep things from getting too cluttered. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're uh, salvaging. That wasn't the repair thing. I thought I was on repair, and then it said it was going to irreversibly kill everything, and I was like, huh? What level are we? We're level 47 here. Oops. So let's see what level 47 armor we can create. Probably nothing. We've already got a level 45 belt, level 40 pants, level 41. Yeah, nothing. All right, so here, before we continue and go on to the uh, climactic finale of the second act here, I'm going to take a quick 20-second break to grab myself some water. Please bear with me. I will be right back. Don't go nowhere.
All right, hey, I'm back. Let's continue the stream here. On to the climactic finale of our uh, second act here. That hopefully won't end with my climactic death, because <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> Sweet! All right, so let's what talk to Adria here and do and Asmodan are trapped funny, goofy... Stone. Then I will kind of dumb, pointless, but interesting and kind of exciting, no cliched story shit. I like, to reach the Emperor. I like he that you know the cynic Lyle. gamer can me can well, insult this can game while giant. also you know we praising no the choice. game at the same time because no it is actually a really it's a fantastic game. He will unleash um, upon Chaldeum. And yeah, there is some kind of laughable elements, but there's laughable elements in any fiction nowadays. So I mean, if you can't if you can't laugh at it and you take it too seriously, I mean, it's just I don't know. I'm sure it's not good for your blood pressure. Let's go. Ashira is already at the sewers. Hurry, we'll keep you safe. Oh shit's going nuts. We gotta do stuff. Actually, shit is technically totally going nuts impossible. right now. Ashira. starting to panic, and he tears the city apart to stop us. He's a bitch. When the fireballs began falling from the sky, we started evacuating the people. They will be safe here. This is some I'll Sodom and Gomorrah shit. Combined. There's too the much awesome sodomy going on death. in this city. We gotta blow everything up. people hiding under the carts. Bring them to the sewers. We can't risk our lives on this foolish heroism. We must go to the Emperor immediately. Yeah, we gotta save these apples. We have to save a certain amount of people, and then uh, we'll go to the boss. No Come here, assholes. I'm going to save your asses. I'm going to do it. This is like totally this game's get to the chopper moment. Get to the chopper! Come on, do it! Kill me! Predator reference! <laughs> So I guess that makes me sexy, big-titted Arnold Schwarzenegger then. Which isn't Arnold Schwarzenegger sexy, big-titted Schwarzenegger? Kill him! Kill him! I wish I could have a commando moment. Come on, get in the hole! There we go, those guys are down. I would really like being able to drop the turrets. I don't know if there's a fail state for this. Like, I don't know if there's a fail state for not saving anyone. Like, I feel like there should be, but I have a feeling that's just kind of a clever game design because you're running around doing it, and there it's kind of... If there is a fail state, it's difficult to get to the fail state, so it's just kind of a... Uh... Come on, kill him. Come on, do it. Kill him now. Predator reference. God, I'm dumb. What is happening? There we go. Let's lead all these people back to the place. Goddamn annoying invisible guys. Luckily, we'll never really have to fight the invisible guys again down. after this. So let's the drop them all off. The drop there off the no kids at the lose. pool, so to speak. Let's yep, go. I just made a poop joke. Oh my god. I like how once... The people go away, there's no more fireballs. I get it, it's like the event is over, but that's still dumb because I thought Belial was now, busy tearing Mia, everything apart. Use your power just the way I Speaking you, of tearing everything apart, it's time to break the walls down. The can't fully control it. I think that's a stupid wrestling reference, but I don't know. <laughs> Shit's going cray cray. Man, my damage potential, I usually keep my damage potential pretty low, but once I, once I turn on all the skills, my damage potential increases by like four times. So I go from basically doing a quarter of my normal damage to like all of my normal damage, like the amount that I'm supposed to be able to do. And it's kind of a, sh not a shocking difference, but it's uh, definitely a much bigger difference than expected. 